Good morning guys, welcome to another episode in our Ultramotive road trip. We are here out in LA. We're gonna head out to a Malibu Cars and Coffee to maybe see some cool cars and also experience what a LA little morning meet is because honestly, I really haven't had the time to do that here. I realize I also have been forgetting about the questions to start off the day. Timothy, howdy. Do you have any uh, good questions to start out the day for today's episode? Oh. What's something that they should consider? Favorite car? For under a hundred grand. Under a hundred grand. Under a hundred thousand dollars. All right, that's US that's the question. Dollars. You guys have a hundred grand. What are you guys gonna spend it on? How are you guys gonna do it? Answer that in the comments below. But with that, we're gonna head out and continue on to our days of vlog. <laughs> That's so loud. <laughs> Holy crap. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry all the neighbors oh, and the God, entire building cool. complex. I don't know if you guys have ever played this game called Grand Theft Auto V, but it's a little OG game. If you look here, we're headed through a tunnel, and this is the exact tunnel that heads out into Santa Monica precisely to the game. Here we are. Oh, oh my. God. my. Oh really man! Fun. But does this look familiar? This is like exactly what it's like in the game. Holy crap, dude! Dude, we're just in our 9F hard hard top, whatever you want to call it. This this is the corner gas station in the map. We may or may not have blown that place up a good amount of times. <laughs> <laughs> to the OG 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 viewers. We are on the route of long haul right now in GTA. We're doing long haul in real life in the R8. This is actually like exactly where you go in our long haul circuit, but comment down below if you know exactly what I'm talking about because probably 90% of you are like, what the heck is he on about? What the heck is a long wall? Ooh, that was a GT3. Casual. <laughs> anything on this road trip it's that it's always worth it to wake up early no matter how painful it's been it's yeah, always honestly, been no. worth it you are 100 percent right about that porsche 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 bmw bmw hey. bmw bmw, BMW. 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 let's go Ooh. zr1 r35 yo we're at the right spot <laughs> oh no oh it's alright. Oh. At least that wasn't a front lift. Alright, so they, uh, they closed off. Hey! Hey, we're invited in. That's pretty sick. Hey. Yo. What? Dude, this is insane. Hey, what's on the roof? Roof box. box. What is that? It's like a ski box, you know? You see it on cars all the time. They store stuff in it. For storage? Yeah, because we have air suspension. It takes up the whole front. Yeah. Oh, is that that's another RA? Yeah, yo, yo. Yeah, right here. Yeah, parking bro. right here. Yeah. yeah, you're good on that, bro. Far next to a 17, matching up. Do it to him. Is this the alright? The <laughs> <laughs> Boom! Cars and coffee, we made it! <laughs> this is That's crazy. Sick. Holy crap, we are out here. Dude, this is so cool! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Dude, this is so cool! <laughs> I know! Just back from Sima. Yep. Oh, nice. Yep. All right, so we came out here to this Cars and Coffee Malibu specifically right, for a certain car that's going to be first time ever on U.S. soil, I believe, debuting here. It's really fitting to the car that we came with. But right behind me, right over here, are the brand new Audi RS6 Avance. Dude, this is, in my opinion, the ultimate daily. Oh yeah. Like, like it doesn't get, yeah, this is the ultimate does. road trip daily car. This would be so I would, nice road trip with. Dude, I would take this in a heartbeat. Holy crap. I love how they have one in red too. But obviously, I've always wanted to experience one and just be around one for the longest time. And we've never had that here in the US. But finally, Audi is bringing it here for us, us Americans. And dude, I couldn't be more excited. I really freaking want one. That's pretty freaking nice, I must say. I love the screen layout and design. 
You tell more cars, more cars are just becoming more and more of a center console having the whole screen. Yep, sorry. The beauty of showing up to a Cars and Coffee that is basically debuting a brand new Audi is that there are nothing but cool Audis that are all over this place. We basically showed up in the perfect car for this event. I mean, I love these Rotiforms, very, very casual stance on here. Then you have the more vibrant, complete crazy camouflage, more Audis over there, really nice blacked out Audi right here on Brixton's. That's sick. And then we have this amazing RS5 here. Absolutely love this color on the Flowform HREs. I don't know who you are, but shout out to you for putting your 911 on freaking Workmeisters right here. The best of the best of the Japanese wheels. Look at that, it's just wrapped right around the brake caliper perfectly. And they really go with this color setup. That's so cool. Major props, major props. Center caps don't move with the wheel. Look at that, it's like a Rolls Royce. They don't move but at all. Not. Tim. Uh. Oh, yo. Look at the freaking. Look at the dog. Got a dog. Oh, boy. Got a King, a King Cavalier. <laughs> That's a good boy. Ah. Yo, this is the real convoy right here, dog. Leg power. <laughs> How many horsepower do you think is in this shot? Dude, we probably got 50 leg powers. <laughs> Tim just ran across the street because there's some really freaking clean BMWs. Oh. Oh. And Oh, dirty as hell. Tim's like... <laughs> Malibu Cars and Coffee, that was a worth it morning spent. Now we gotta go get some breakfast. I recognize this place. Oh. Ooh! It's when you know you're on Rodeo Drive, baby. We've made it to the Beverly Hills. What do you think? I mean, Tim's aviators already fit the look. I, should, I gotta take off my hoodie and get, get my formal clothing on so that we kind of fit inside some of the shops, but this is so surreal. I've never been here before. This I know. Is we got the Hollywood tours. Time. We just got everything. Louis V. Yeah, blue and scored glasses. <laughs> this is so cool. Are right, these are yours? When you go from 50% to 95% Chinese in a matter of <laughs> one second. <laughs> 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 so, so these are for your M3 and then these are for me? Yes. <laughs> I'll put a little white stripe down the side. Yeah, just take With a little ultramotive. <laughs> just vinyl from your car. <laughs> so you can either get a used Audi R8 V8 or you can get. A mink coat. Oh my that is god. $48,000. <gasps> you touched it. Oh, totaled. Part out. My, my human worth value is now increased. <laughs> this is this is very Asian. <laughs> I want to see a white male. <laughs> this is not. <laughs> no, that's in your car. A white 40 year old male. <laughs> I've always wanted to do this with a bagged car, but what we're gonna do is that Tim is in the car. Since I don't have the whole Bluetooth mobile phone thing hooked up to the airlift, he is gonna press the button when people are walking by. It's basically gonna air out, and we're just gonna try and get people's reactions to all the noise and everything. We got a crowd coming up here soon. Yeah. All right, right now. <laughs> that was good, that was good, that was good. Alright, now you can air it back up. Oh, you got a guy freaking out. Air it back up. Dude, this guy with the jean jacket is freaking freaking out. How about these guys walking up to it? 
Okay. Go for it. <laughs> Dude, I love this. This is so funny. Does he know? Yeah, he knows who you are. Oh, no way. I'll come by. I'll come by. No way. Dude, what's up? What is good, bro? Hey. Dude, I saw your reaction. I was like, this guy I'm is... in the video. Yeah, dude. We're doing a reaction video right now. Have so you been wait. in an R8 before? No, I've never been in an R8. Do you want to sit in it? <laughs> oh Alright, excuse the mess in there, but yeah, go for it, buddy. Oh my god! <laughs> this is awesome. That is crazy. Yo, get my picture. <laughs> yeah. That is crazy. <laughs> yup. <laughs> <laughs> a small one, yeah. What are yours, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm not afraid. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> when he realizes that oh. he's blue M3. Oh my <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Right there, right there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I think you lost half a modified exhaust. Right? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. There's an A90 Supra. Oh my god. <laughs> this is... Yeah, nice Supra. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now we should have aired out. We've made it back to our hotel, and that is going to conclude today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed all the awesome reactions, because Beverly Hills is definitely the one place to go, believe it or not, for an R8, which there's constantly cars driving around that are worth 10 times more. People still, I mean, a red roof box, a big red car, and we can't forget the air ride, which is like the fun thing that we were testing out all the reactions for. So anyways, leave a fat like. Let me know if you want to see more kind of like reaction style videos like this. And with that, this is going to be Jack Ultra Motive signing the video off. Bye. Ultra.